It's amazing to be in the kitchen giving your favorite recipes and ideas. Anyway, thank you so much for tuning into my show, guys. And I know we are always giving you lovely recipes and ideas. Anyway, a few weeks ago, I did this chicken breast, pan fried chicken breast, cooking down, bake it off in the oven. And a lot of fans were saying, Chef, I gotta send me the recipe. You like the recipe. Anyway, um, this is how I marinate it. Yeah, first thing you need to do is to marinate it. You will see I come with the next video or I cook it. So please look out for the next video, guys. But the first thing what you need to do is to marinate your chicken breast. That's the first thing what you're gonna need to do, guys. Anyway, thank you for tuning in and please subscribe to the YouTube channel. Leave your comments in the description box. And I'm telling you guys, 50 or 60, 100, even 100 likes on this video will be really great. Please share the video and please tell a friend and also click in the bell notification you first will be getting knowing what's going on um new year resolution you need to leave it in the description box tell me what you've been doing and what's going on in your in your new year resolution with chef record on the team stay tuned and don't go anywhere leave your comments if you want me to cook it and show you the full recipe again Nice and lovely. Welcome back in the kitchen again with Chef Ricardo Cooking Show. It's amazing to be in the kitchen, guys, giving your favorite recipes and ideas. Anyway, you know, a few days ago, I did that video talking about how we're going to give you the recipe of, you know what I mean, doing the chicken breast. So right here, as you can see, I have a probably about almost eight pieces of chicken breast which I want to be using up. And I want to do something really fantastic with it today. First of all, what I'm going to do, if it doesn't have one of these garlic crusher, you need to have one. All right. Remember, this is my. Look at this nice, lovely chicken breast, looking lovely and nice. All right. So what I want to do is to put some garlic on my chicken breast, just like this. And I'm going to show you something. This is I always say to my fans, and you need to have this garlic crusher at home. All right, guys, it's just really fantastic to have at home to do little bits and pieces or you don't like to do. So I'm squeezing out some garlic, as you can see, roughly about five to cover of, cold of garlic. Once I get the garlic squeezed out, yeah, that's it right here. That's the garlic. Nice and lovely. So that's the garlic finish. What I want to simply say to you, when you're doing chicken, all right, the first thing what you need to do is this. Marinate it up with the garlic. All right? Oh, can't waste my garlic, you know. Once you marinate up the chicken breast with the garlic, This is what you want to do. The first thing is rub on that nice, lovely garlic. All right, looking amazing already. Um, second thing is going to get some some of your favorite. Paprika is a must to give it a little bit of color. You know, I mean, a lot of people doing chicken, but paprika do give you a chicken color. To be honest, I love my paprika. Um, gonna be putting on some mixed herb, roughly about half tablespoon of mixed herb. Large tablespoon of all purpose season. Yeah, that's looking good. And 
half teaspoon of everyday season. That's a pinch of garlic and salt. tablespoon of oil yeah that looking lovely and nice and that's exactly what I'm talking about keep the thing up to date This tablespoon of chicken season. Mm -hmm. Make sure you put on them thing that you know what I mean. Some people do put on like white onion, spring onion, you know what I mean, and um, some thyme, but um. I don't have any time at the moment, but I have my natural blending season, which have everything inside of it. So we're gonna put roughly about quarter tablespoon of the blending season. Look at that nice blending season. See that? Yeah. That's exactly what I'm talking about natural stuff can go around all right guys yeah mm -hmm. that looking good so what you need to do now is marinate him up like this you know make sure everything marinate up and good and nice these chicken breasts is really massive as you can see don't get me wrong but when you fry them pan fry them out first honestly they just like they just shrink so I remember in a couple couple of weeks I went mean, last few, few Sundays ago I did that video on the chicken breast and everyone was saying they need to see the recipe so I said I'm gonna show them how I marinate it so this is the way I marinate my chicken breast. Uh, this one is really massive chicken breast, guys. Honestly, these are not like these are the really nice, lovely, expensive chicken breasts. All right, as you can see, that's all I did in the video of the other chicken breast, which video I'm talking about. But if you want me to cook it now, you know, they need to leave. A comments in the description box a thousand like on this video and then now we'll be 100% happy but this is exactly what I was saying look how easy and simple you can do a simple like a dish um, marinate chicken or you know what I mean marinate and your fish beef whatever at home very easy like this and you can just cook it come out really lovely like this look at that amazing chicken breast marinated ready for cook off and I know you guys definitely will be loving this 100% this one all you have to do you can either bake it or you can either pan fry it off and then put it in the oven and you know what I mean but definitely I get at least say 50 likes on this video I will be happy guys a really amazing dish
see exactly how that looking so lovely and nice and amazing. And anyway, guys, tune in to more recipes and more ideas from Chef Ricardo. Definitely 100% I will be coming with more. Stay tuned.